That is me, here to confirm the job gets done. Oh, shit. You were about to get capped on, dude. <laughs> okay, so that one guy is down. He dropped like a fucking fly, dude. Didn't even know what was up. Hello everyone, welcome back to DOJ. Today we are getting in here doing some Agent 48. It has been months and months and months since this character has been out on the field committing murders. Uh, this time we're going to open it up to the Twatter universe and we are going to let people just pick off people that owe the money they don't like or that have had some type of issue. This fucking chair makes so much noise. Like, see, you see this? That's probably what people thought like 20 videos ago or something where they thought I like shit my pants while recording. It was definitely not. It's it's my chair. I don't know why it does that. I don't even know how that would sound. I have to wait till playback. Anyways, we are going to be doing Agent 48. This is kind of like Agent 48.1. It's a different face character, but I just wanted something like a little different. So that way Agent 48 could just kick it old school and like, you know, like off time really quick and he'll come back. But I think 48.1 can go ahead and handle some shit. That way, in case 48.1 dies, we don't have to worry. You know what I mean? I think that's a huge important part to this, is we just don't have to worry about that character being, poof, gone. Uh, but then again, 48 and that whole company of Hitman, they have great doctors that are willing to revive these non-human-like motherfuckers that are killing machines. So anyways, let's go ahead and get it started. Yes, of course, we have our classic red vehicle, but it's a little different than last time because that trainer is gone and I had to redo the vehicle, but I think this one looks super sleek. We put a lot more modifications on it than last time, and I hope that's the right vehicle. So 48.1 is going to be borrowing 48's car. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel or have been new in the past couple months, 48 is a character that's based off of Hitman. I love that show. I don't know if you guys have seen it. Car's locked. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen that, but I just absolutely love, uh, not the show, but the game and the movies. They're both amazing. Uh, game... I like more, um, but I decided to incorporate that character in GTA, and this is what we are doing now. We are incorporating, again, 48.1, because 48's on vacation, um, you know, because killers need time off too, right? I would say so. Um, so let's go ahead, we're going to get this started again. Twatter Universe, uh, it's going to be a little different. I don't know if this is going to get us caught up with the cops, but this is why I wanted a different char character. Don't mind my at Agent 4875. <laughs> That's so good. Okay, uh, slash twatter. Want someone gone? Owe you money? Just don't like the way they dress? Call 1-800-HITMANS. <laughs> Oh my god, that works too good. <laughs> or contact on Twitter. Okay. There we go. So we got the ad out. I got all my weapons, but because of course we're hitmans, so we're not going to go to the store and get them. Um, there's a ton of civilians in game, so we're going to be able to... Oh wow, cool, it makes mine stand out with red. That's much needed. Um, looks like we have some people. I'm going to tell them a, pl a meeting place. Meet at 969 Marina Drive. Meet at 969 Marina Drive. There we go. Okay, I gotta go get gas and all that, because you can't do... What the fuck was that? Did that guy just do, like, the jankest U-turn ever? I gotta go get gas before we do anything. I'm sure we're gonna get a few contracts today. Uh, we have a few people on the way. I don't know what their story is going to be on why they want these people dead. But Agent 48 is back, and he is going to make a presence. Oh, shit. I thought that was a cop, but it's a minivan. Those fucking minivans, dude. Fuck you and your minivan. Motherfucker. I had to add, like, the the effect of, like, driving away. You know, fuck you and your minivan. Make it seem like we were driving away from him. All right, I got to get to that gas station. It'd probably be best if I just went to the gas station down on Panorama there. I could have sworn I filled this bitch up before I... That's where I originally started, like, getting my clothes ready and all that stuff. But I was like, I need kind of like a, like a staging spot, you know, like a, a, a pre-murder spot, a pre-planning spot where I, where I meet all my clients. No one ever said it was a nice spot, I just needed a spot. And I think that, like, old crack house that we used to have in the ESX servers, 
uh, would, would work fine over there. I gotta get this fucking gas, so. This thing is completely modded out, too, so it should help us, you know, get out of a situation if we, if we really need to. And that's important when you're a hitman, because we do get in situations where firing a gun gets us caught up by a lot of cops. But fun fact about this time, usually I'll leave a few guns unsilenced because I love gun sounds so much in this game when they're modded. Um, fuck, I'll just go to Panorama. And, um, okay. Just passed on a double yellow. That's, that's cool. I don't think cops should be able to... <laughs> he better not be ha heading to that house. Uh, I may need your services for a very important reason at some point in the near future. Please, key. Okay, there it is. I have to respond back. I do have someone that's gonna need a contract now though, so that is a plus, but I will text them. Oh, that's a lot of cops driving that way. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Let me look for their name. Why am I not seeing it? Really? Oh, okay, uh, 259. 259. All right, we'll just let him, uh, let me know. I gotta get to down to my house. I don't know if that's all these cops heading down that way because of what's going on, or if it's just because I have random ass cops going down that way. I don't know, I couldn't tell you, but we're gonna find out. What is up with all the shitty ass fucking drivers? I will 48 your punk ass motherfucking self. Don't, we have not been this character in a while and I could tell you we used to fucking, we used to murder people that cut us off and shit, so we will do what we have to do. Blood needs to be shed for this organization, okay? And our organization of Hitmans is a secret organization, unlike the pinks, the yellows, the blues, the ranches, the ketchups, the condiments, whatever it is out there, it doesn't matter. This is the most fierce organization because it's just down to murder. I say, fuck it, don't even pay me money, I'll just murder for fun. I don't give a shit. I should probably stay on the outer road. I should not go. No, I'll, I'll go on this road so I can see in front of that building. Chances are, did that guy back up or he's just parked like a fucking jackass? Holy shit. 731 Panorama Drive at the motel so we could talk business. What is this? You don't want... What, uh, uh, no. 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 No, Blake. It's not how it's gonna go down. I don't tell you where to meet. Oh, wait. I don't- you don't tell me where to meet. I tell you where to meet. Uh... I, I- the reason why I don't want them to... Shit. Alright, I'll drive by the location. I can't remember- okay, what is it? Uh... Read... 731 Panorama Drive. At the motel. Man, I was just over there. Son of a bitch. Well, do I have anyone else here? Any other clients? I'll get this one first. Fuck it. I don't- I wish he would've texted me a little sooner than that. Is it gonna disappear? I was gonna say, holy shit, that's lasts forever on the second round versus the first one. Okay, so the cops were not suspicious about my location, which is a plus. Considering the fact that we just put that shit out in twatter. Now I can start navigating through uh, the personal messages. So maybe it would be smarter to go to the motel instead of my aired location on Twatter. It doesn't seem like that would be the smartest idea. So this seems a little smarter, unless this is some type of undercover cop uh, trying to get me stinged up in like a fucking hitman investigation or murder for hire investigation or some shit like that. That's not what we need. I wish I had no plate, but we're just gonna keep an unregistered vehicle. As long as I don't get caught doing anything dumb, then an unregistered vehicle shouldn't be too bad, even though I probably should register it. I should register it under a fake name, though. Let's drive by before we tell him we're on our way. That way he doesn't have any connection about us being the hitman. What is going on there? Um... I'm not liking this. I could have sworn I saw someone else. I'm gonna pull a Yui really quick. I'm gonna park across the street. We're gonna be smart about this.
Okay, I'm across the street on Zancudo. Okay, what's his name? It is Jacob. Finding names in this list is just horrendous. Uh, let me do... Oh, there's a cop in that parking lot. 7-3, oh, Blake, okay, um... 194. Oh, that cop hit someone. I want to make sure he's in my car. What is going on over there? That guy's about to fight him. Oh! Oh, Jesus. Oh, he just got ran over. Oh! No fucks. What is this? Were you not just in a car? Now you're in that bitch? Catchy. I don't like this. What's up? Oh. Hey. What's up, man? I'm gonna drive around while we talk. I'll bring you back to this spot. Alright. So what do you want? Alright, man. This is cop. It's a deputy. Oh, shit. It's a cop. Me and I want him Gage L. Gage L. What does he drive? Uh, he drives a car. He drives a couple different cars. So I don't know what it'd be in. Well, you gotta give me more information than this to be able to find this guy. I can't just pull him out of my ass. Maybe I should give you some time to do a little bit of digging on him. I need at least a vehicle so that way I could try to pick out which vehicle he's in out of all the cops. He, he, man, he drives a, he drives a Crown Vic. He's a highway. He's a highway. I have business proposition for you. Okay. All right. Uh, any more information that I could use? Why am I pointing like a motherfucker? Know, man. That's all I know. That's all you know. Is that the guy you're driving with? Uh, the one in front of me, in front of us. I don't know. Oh, okay. Let me find out. Well, he's... I was gonna follow him, but never mind. Okay, this yeah, has been like... Him, man. Okay, well, too late now. He's coming up behind us. Drop me a bag off right here. How much you want? We'll talk pricing when I get done. Oh my god, he won't stop pointing. Alright, right, I'll hit you up. What is this? This is, uh... This is... La, 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 la. Jacob, I think. Way, <laughs> Seems what legit. Even no, it's Blake. Okay, I wanted to write down that information. So we have another one. Let's go ahead and see what this guy. Hello, Mr. 48. I have a business proposition for you if you are available. Let's have multiple, so that way, in case I don't get done, I have people to come back to. This is Jagger. So, it's gonna be Jagger, who is... I see him right there. 272. Jagger. 272. Um, let's text him back. Text. 272. Yes, I am. Meet at Yellow Jack. All right, we'll keep the ball rolling on targets. Like I said, we have a highway patrol named Gage L. Who somehow I wrote his last name letter down with a fucking like, looks like an E. Okay, let's change that. L, okay. Go. With your shitty ass car. So it's a highway guy that mostly drives a Crown Vic. So that's going to be interesting. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to know exactly who it is because all the cops look alike. And I didn't think it was going to be a cop target. I thought they were going to kill each other. Uh, but I guess, you know, a lot of these people are just... A lot of these people are just fucking over, 
Over, getting pulled over. There it is. What the fuck? That rhymed. And that could work on some type of slogan thing or something. And God only knows what this guy is driving. And I could have picked a more fucking... I will be inside. No, 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 no. Uh, text 272 in parking lot come inside my red vehicle. I knew how to spell. You need to watch where you're driving there, Lucas. Don't Lucas? What is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh no, this is him. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Mr. Yeah, you you wanna you wanna step inside? There we go. Yes. Would you mind if my son uh, also steps inside if you're going for the ride? Yeah, I'll, I'll keep an eye out. Don't worry about. Bots. I like to drive and talk. That way, no one can coordinate us. So if you want to hop in, that's fine. Yeah, all right, I'll keep an eye on you. Can keep my pops safe. <laughs> he has a gun in his hand. Holy shit! And a silencer, I think. All right, let's go ahead and just ran over his door. We're gonna hit harmony. So, what are you? What are you looking for? You're looking to make someone disappear. If that is uh, a service you provide. That's definitely possible. Who we? Who we talking about? I'm gonna run it. The man in question works for the highway patrol. Oh He's fuck. The name of Dalia. Oh come on. I got a cop contract right now. I gotta work on. Is there anyone else that might not be a cop? <laughs> like Jesus! Good God! <laughs> well, uh, that means I mean, anyone know. else you hate? I mean, anyone but yeah, a cop. <laughs> like Jesus! Good God! Yeah, Everyone wants a cop them, killed. Man, you know, unless you wanna fuck over those Russians, but I mean, uh, we ain't got time for that bullshit today, do we? <laughs> like, what is this? Yeah, yeah, all the cops would be dead by the time I'm done with them. Yeah, I don't mind doing one, Russians, but I don't need so to kill multiple count. cops here. Like, shit. See, I'm just gonna keep it nice and smooth down, down this road. A, uh, Finally figured out the cruise the control vehicles. as well, which helps for this situation right here. So who are we looking like? What are we gonna do here? Well, it should be clean unless you want to make him suffer. Okay, who is it though again? Uh, my boy, do you remember his last name? Is, uh, I keep thinking he's saying, something. I want my boy killed, but he's talking uh, about his son. The name of some kind of vodka, I think? Smir Smirnoff or something? Oh, yes, yes, uh, Boris Smirnoff. Boris? Okay, that is him. I, uh, I could send some of my men to do a reconnaissance, and uh, I could inform you of his whereabouts when we are able to locate him. What is, what kind of car does he drive? I have most often seen them in uh, all black vehicles. Uh, oh, usually, all black. Uh, the benefactors. Okay, Shafter, uh, Benefactor Shafter. Usually. Let's see, Ben. I'm writing this down. Factor. Yeah, sometimes you see him rolling around in some flashy bullshit, like some uh, golden cars, all that. Gold cars. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm writing this down. Oh, shit. <laughs> Just don't write and drive at the same time. Okay, I, uh, any other things that would help me identify them? Gold cars. But he's Russian as fuck. I'm sorry? You say Russian as fuck? He always wears a suit. Yes. I'm gonna just put he down Russian so as fuck, which is uh, RAF. He also wears a uh, sort of uh, trench coat type of thing. Trench All coat. Black. Don't mind me and my driving when I'm doing this. Oh. Yeah, around with a lot of uh, a lot of fools, you know. Like to wear uh, gold chains and track suits. Gold chains, <laughs> tracks. Yes, it's uh, quite horrendous if you ask me myself. So you want them all killed, or or just that one guy, or what? I believe I just Boris, but if he has an associate with him, that wouldn't uh, would help as well. Boris is hey, the leader ups. currently. Perhaps this is our opportunity to wipe that scourge off the earth, you know? I mean, uh, <laughs> this is just the worst. <laughs> opportunities. Exactly. Oh, yes, God. With, uh, other people. Take, them all, take them all out. 
Okay. Uh, what are you thinking, uh, payment price? I'll say 50 ahead. That sounds bad. That could be arranged. <laughs> that could be arranged? Cash or a direct bank deposit? Oh, definitely cash. Why the fuck would we you do a direct <laughs> bank deposit? That much cash could, uh, just have to let me know how many you take out. Of course, would require some kind of proof for how many. Oh! Uh, oh, what the this is a situation. And that man just got the curb stomped by the deputy. Yeah, quite a... It's oh! Quite the work you got up here. Damn! <laughs> that just man. got knocked the fuck out. Well, that's, that's Blaine County for you. Yes. Uh, too damn true. <laughs> I was gonna shoot him, but I realized we don't have the reticule on this map and I was waiting for it to pop up. And I was just... I didn't want to really shoot in front of that cop. It wouldn't have been worth it. I had a silencer, but it just would not have been worth it. Don't worry about yeah, the cost, Mr. Uh, uh... Don't worry about the cost, Mr. Uh, Hitman Ripoff. Uh, money's no object to us, you know? Alright, well, I will yeah, work so on that. Uh... I will definitely work on that. What is going on here? When we figure out where they are... There you go. Shit. Enjoy! Yeah, just shoot me a message if you find out anything. I'm gonna start working on both these contracts, but I appreciate it. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Have a good night. You too. Everything good? <laughs> everything good? Yes, yes, everything good. Everything is. great, my friend. Is here, huh? Everything is great. He's he just I'm bought the contract for 50,000. It's like, what the Freaking fuck? Oh, Jesus. No one answers to you. Yeah. Oh, it's Amanda. Uh, oh, I should put gloves on. Uh, yeah. Oh. oh, not on my screen. I almost said uh, it. Quite well, quite well. Just, uh. uh Oof, that was close. What happened here? Oh, that person is drunk oh, as fuck. Uh, had to ship it over here from... Okay, I gotta fix my life up a little. We have a window broken. Fucking prick. God damn, no one gives a fuck here. Go. I'm gonna go across the street. Yeah, I'm just gonna get my life together. We're gonna figure out some of the details on this contract. And we are gonna get them started. So I have to read a last message. I had to step out and go grab my camera battery to be able to, the Russians, okay, hold on. The Russians operate out of a house, the lighthouse, 801 lighthouse. Oh, that should be easy as hell to hit that. I'll go do that one first. And then that leaves us with the uh, officer that we have to do, which is gonna be kind of hard. And I was honestly shocked when both of the people that I met up with wanted officers to be killed first. That's just, uh, it's, uh, I wasn't expecting that. Let me pull over really quick. I gotta get the lighthouse on, uh, the map. 801. What is that? Hold on. Yeah, 801. Okay, so we're gonna make our way to there. It's about two miles if we take the freeway. And, uh, it actually shouldn't be too bad. I believe these hits should be very easy, especially on these guys if they're operating out of a lighthouse tucked so far back out there that I could take the silencers off my- What the fuck? I could take the silencers off my weapon and I could kill them that way, but uh, we're gonna have to stop and I'm gonna have to get my fucking car fixed because I bashed the shit out of those water barrels. Oh fuck, dude. Keep it smooth. Let's speed up now. I wonder how much worse my car looks on his screen versus mine. I mean, it looks bad on mine, but I'm sure it looks pretty god-awful on his. Um, so let's find a mechanic shop that we can go to before we start taking out these targets. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of one-way one roads here. So we have to be a little bit careful on, you know, them seeing us and all that stuff when we actually get on the road. As long as we can uh, make it through there, we should be good, and we could, like, uh, perch up on... I think they have hills across the street from that lighthouse, if I'm not mistaken. I don't roleplay down there that much, nor have I even been down there when I played GTA regular. So I'm not sure if that's gonna be, uh, something. And I don't see a fucking mechanic shop. We're just gonna have to make do with what we got. Um, I really can't go and spend more time doing that when we have targets, and this is big money here. Uh, and the vehicle is not damaged to where it's an issue or anything like that. Obviously, we drove past that cop. He didn't even bat an eye towards us, so that's what we want to look for. If it was bad enough to where we had a tail light out, I think we'd be screwed, but it's just a headlight and a, well, our full front 
windshield's gone, so that's kind of illegal. Oh, what is this? Is that the vehicle? Let's see. Boris Smirnoff, Benefactor Shafter. Oh my god, I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. I'm gonna turn left here. That has to be him. Holy shit. Okay, if that's him, he is literally right there. So I'm gonna post up right here. I'm gonna be one with these poles, you're gonna see. No one ever drives on this road too, so I should be able to post up without any problems. I need to get gloves. I can't do this without gloves, so let me do that really quick. Even if we lose tabs on this target, I need gloves. I can't not have any gloves. I want some like nice... Come on, give me some nice black gloves. There we go. There's Agent 48. I knew something looked a little weird. And this time we have the wood finished sniper rifle. Oh no, target's still there. So we're gonna sit in just enough way that coming down this road you won't see me, and coming down that road you won't see me. It's going to be perfect. I can't have tabs on the target, I don't see him. Oh shit. He's driving. Oh, I'm glad I put that weapon away and started walking, dude. Holy shit. <coughs> oh, shit. I just sneezed. Okay, I apologize for the sneeze there if you guys heard that, and I did not edit that out. This guy pulled over from down there, and now he's up by my car. I really don't know what he's doing. 272. Let me see if the car is white and black. I need to get a verification on this before I just open fire on someone. We don't want to kill the wrong target. I'm going to be patient here for a second. I'm sure he saw me, but at this point, I've pretty much looked like I've just disappeared versus anything. I, I can't be seen with a gun, though. That's not, not a good idea. Let's play it smart here. Trying to wait for a text back to see if this is a verification on our guy or not. That is me, here to confirm the job gets done. Oh, shit. You were about to get capped on, dude. <laughs> like, shit. Oh. I didn't know you were going to be this close to the area. I almost shot you in the face. <laughs> you might want to stay back a little next time. <laughs> Collateral damage is serious. I understand the confusion. Yeah, all right. Well, I'm gonna head in there then. Almost quite bad. Yeah, it's just down the road there. Oh yeah, I know where it was at. I just, I got, I got pushed off a little because I thought you were them setting up a roadblock. But yeah, I'll, I'll head in. I see. Yes. Uh, good luck. Thank you. All right. So that would have been really bad. I would have shot the guy that ordered the hit. That's a good hitman right there. That's how you know you're fucking with someone who's high quality and and class. What is that shit? That was an actual person walking down the road. So. I do know where to go, I do know where to take this adventure, um, but that could have took a very bad path. <laughs> a very bad path. Because I would have thought I had the target, I would have just left the guy that was supposed to be, I don't know, it would have it been so bad. Okay, so this is a target, I'm going to have to go through the hills here, so I think it would be best if we parked our car here. Let's park it right here. Let's not be too jank, you know what I mean? Stay off the road, that way if cops come in, everything seems normal. So we're gonna get out and actually turn the vehicle off. We're gonna lock it, that way no one can steal it. Even though I, don't, I wouldn't want to steal a car that had... Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. That was him. That's that's like one of the fucking cars in Hitman Absolution that they drove. That the gang drove. Holy shit, that's crazy, dude. What the fuck? Trippy. Um, Alright, we're gonna make it up this hill here. As you can see, they just pulled into the property. I assume that was one of them. We're looking for a Borish Smirnoff. We're not gonna be able to do identification on his name. 
unfortunately. Oh, no. No, oh, that's not good. Oh, my God. I picked up a lot of speed right there. Holy shit, dude. Okay, just shake yourself off, buddy. It's okay. You're you're an agent. You're good. You are good, my friend. All right, I got to get out to this uh, flat level here. This is going to be our area of operations, which is going to be pretty much this hill. Let me get the sniper so I can get a little better. Oh, yeah. I got eyes on him right here. He's leaving. Keep it normal. No one looks up here when they're driving. He is bouncing back and forth super quick. Is there anyone else on property? I don't know. I hear the ocean and shit. I do not see... What is that? That's good target practice. Okay, well there you go. That did nothing. Fantastic. Okay, let's get to a better perch. Uh, this tree is actually really bad. Like, uh, just absolutely horrendous. That it's right here in this location. It's almost- Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we got a, uh... We got a guard here. I believe this is a guard. He's walking around with a weapon. Okay, okay, okay. So there's tabs of people. There's tabs of people. I like this. I like this a lot. I don't know if this is a target, but they said take out everyone. So what I should do is wait till his partner to get back on scene, unless there's someone else around that other side that I haven't... He's coming back. That I haven't been able to see yet. They got a gardener... I'm taking out secondaries right now. There we go. That way I can move up. If I can move up before that car gets in there, then I'll be a little better, you know what I mean? Like, I'll have a- I don't even think he heard that shot, that's scary. He is just post- oh, there's another car there. Oh no. I didn't even see all that shit when I was- okay, I gotta move up. We're gonna move up on the, uh... Oh, he's looking at the wrong direction, buddy. You are not paying attention. Hashtag Bartyguard who? Okay, let's move up in here. I'm gonna just have the pistol in my hand. Thus way, we have some element of shooting back if that's what we have to do. Okay, that perch only goes around on one side, so we should be able to get some shots off on this side. Oh my god, that actually crashes against her. That's crazy. <gasps> right there. Shit. Oh, shit. Okay, they have... <laughs> Holy shit, this is sick. I feel like I'm actually doing like a fucking little mission here. Holy crap, dude. What the fuck? Am I playing GTA or am I playing fucking the new Hitman? Fuck. God. Leave it up to the people at DOJ to help you complete something. I had no idea this was going to happen. I was just like, yeah, uh, I need some targets. I had no idea they were going to take it this far. Let's get into this bush here. Oh my god, they got guns and sh- This is crazy. Okay. Oh, fuck. There they are. Okay, let's get out a weapon. I don't know where the main target's at. Is it just two people? That's a pretty big gun. I don't know, it's hard to tell if that's the main guy. I don't- I wouldn't understand how the high value target would be the one carrying a weapon too, you know what I mean? Like, that doesn't make much sense to me. Oh, we should put a sticky bomb on the car. That would be so sick. Okay, we're gonna try this. Oh shit! I, I threw it way too high, bro! Okay. Oh god. There we go. I nailed on the car. That's gonna be one big-ass fucking explosion, dude. Holy shit. 
Okay, if they get in that car, that's gonna be dope as shit. I don't think there's any more- see, they're not doing a full coverage job. They could. Okay, he's back up there. Let's go ahead. We're gonna kill that guy once this other guy walks around the... ...the house. Like, see how he's doing full circles around the house? We lost- There he is. Watch this. Okay, we're gonna move in. Okay, one down. He doesn't even know what hit him. The other guy's still walking. That guy's dead. They didn't even notice that, though. I want to stay eyes on that car. Eyes on that car. That way he doesn't run. Okay, I don't think he knows that his buddy's down. Shit. Oh shit, I don't even think he saw that. <laughs> oh, this is great! Okay, so that one guy is down, he dropped like a fucking fly, dude. Didn't even know what was up. And see, this is why we like the reticule gun, because it's so much more fucking realistic, shooting through a bush. Oh, he's donezo, dude. I can first person this shit. Oh man, I want to do it! Oh my god, his buddy's over the ledge and he doesn't even see it! How the fuck did he see his buddy? How the fuck did he see his buddy? Oh my god, is that all of them? <laughs> is that all of them? Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta make sure they're dead. I gotta make sure they're dead. That black car hasn't came back. Shit. 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 They might be bodyguards. Alright, let's do... Let's grab them. Can I grab them? Ah, oh, fuck. I can't grab them. God damn it. No! I was gonna move their bodies. Shit, it's not letting me move their body! And there's one still- oh no, this isn't good. The guy that we need to get, I think, is... Okay, we're bouncing. Both targets have been eliminated. Let me just go ahead and record their bodies really quick. That way, for the client, they know. Okay. That way the, uh, client has confirmation of the dead bodies. So by, this is why you don't pick an area. I mean, it's a beautiful home. And I, and I mean, it's great, a compound, but you need more people. Like, if you had, like, five, eight people, it would have been so much more difficult to kill those people and to not be seen by other people than just two guys. Because the one guy sniped off. I didn't know he fell off the ledge and... Onto the ground. I don't know if that guy saw that or what, but totally oblivious as hell that that even happened. We're gonna bounce from this location. Oh, I should set it on fire. I should have set it on fire. I should have set it on fire. Oh no, I gotta get my car and go back there. I think I gotta get my car and go back there. Shit. I only say that because evidence, if you light it on fire, it's literally gone. So if we light that whole place on fire, not only do we have a reasonable way of not getting caught for these crimes, but we also have a reason for them not to just sit there for hours and end and pretend to be dead when no one will ever know because it technically is a hitman job. Let's go ahead and unlock it. Break your window because why not? Get in, buddy. Get in. You gotta go light it on fire. As long as- oh, you know what? Oh, shit. Let's go light it on fire really quick. And then I'm gonna go back to the end and see if that guy comes back. Alright, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna go here. Here. Flash start. Fire. We're gonna do five by five. 
There we go. Oh, that's a small fire. That's small. Let me do a start. Fuck. Slash start fire. 30, 30. There we go. I want something a little bigger, you know what I mean? Oh shit, my car. Oh no, my car. Oh shit. Okay, that's... That's a pretty big fire. I've done 200 by 200 and it hasn't looked that big. Holy shit. Okay, maybe I should have fixed my car. Holy mother of God, that is huge. I don't know what happened there. But that is a pretty big fire. That whole house is now engulfed. The two bodies are gonna be charred to death. I was gonna wait out here for that other black car to come in. But at this point, I think it's best that we leave because our car is super fucked up. We gotta go to like Main Street Harmony or uh, Main Street Grapeseed. Okay, so it looks like that target isn't even here either. Um, let me go down this way. I need to get my vehicle fixed. Okay. Alright. Alright, looks like uh, two targets have been taken out. I would suggest getting out of here. Amazing. I will... I'll, uh, arrange payment to, uh... Yeah, I'll email you the rest, and I'll also email you the footage. <laughs> the footage, there it is. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Alright. do business again sometime. Just... Uh, quick and efficient. Just hit me up. Will do. Have a good day. You too. Alright, I gotta go get my car fixed. ASAP. Um, oh sh shit. Maybe we should tell a cop that- Get off my ass, you fucking asshole. Maybe we should tell a cop that there's a fire at the lighthouse. You know what I mean? Instead of just- Cause that shit's gonna burn. And it's gonna burn good. Alright, let's go this way. I was gonna go get my car fixed there, but there's a, a mechanic at the corner down here. Fuck you, you cock sucker. Oh, no, 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 no. I thought it had a silencer. What, 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 what? Why? Why? Why did it not have a silencer? Oh, well, at least he's gone. That's all that matters, I guess. Um, okay, yeah, so let's go ahead and tell the cop that we... Uh, that we see smoke? How would I, how would I say this? That there's smoke over at the lighthouse at 801. Or that's 901, one of the two. Let's pull up right here. This car sucks when it has no fucking balls. Like, what the fuck? It is just the shittiest thing. Come on, fix me up. Now I gotta go run to the sheriff's station. We usually don't do this. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna put it out, um... I'm gonna put it out on Twatter. Oh my god, that was him right there. That was a contract guy. I'm gonna put it out on Twatter. That way, people know that there's a fire going on. That way they can maybe get, um... A fire department down there. So we'll do Twatter... Lighthouse fire at 801. That way people know. And if I find a cop, I can I can let him know, but we still have one officer that we were requested to get, which was Gage. Um, this has taken quite some time though, but I mean, I just don't know where that highway guy would be at. He hasn't presented any more information, and honestly, that contract doesn't seem sufficient enough as per the second one I got, which is... It had so much information, you know what I mean? Like, the information was there, I was able to find the targets. I can't just... I don't know, I, I can't just... find someone out of nowhere, it's quite difficult, actually. Um, so I don't know where the hell they're at. But as of right now, that is, uh, we have one outstanding contract. And one contract that has been fulfilled. Two targets down in that, in, in the first contract we did, actually. Which, uh, I gotta admit, worked out pretty well. There's a huge fire going on right now. Um, but that's dissipated all the evidence that would, uh, correlate me to those murders, I would think. Considering the fact that we blew up their vehicle, we shot them in the face, 
And, uh, yeah, I just think it was good. I'm gonna let this cop know right here. What? I'm not sure if you got. Oh. I'm not- I'm not sure if you guys know, there's a fire at the lighthouse. What? At the lighthouse? Oh, what? oh. Well, if they actually oh. fire, there's you. You're hot. Oh, there it is. Great. You talking about the lighthouse over there near- 801. Uh, okay. I'll get some people over there right away. Okay, alright. Have a good one. Appreciate it. Yep. Yeah, You're welcome, you guys. What? Okay, so that was a guy that lit the fire and also killed the two bodies that are in the fire, just letting the cops know that there is a fire, but you gotta love it. Uh, but it's best that they know that that's going on instead of just burning away and withering everyone in that part of the map. Um, but yeah, it was weird that that, like, 30 by 30 was actually pretty big, it seemed like. I was quite shocked by that. Um, at this point, there is no contracts. We've been in game for about an hour. I have that one other one left, but to go up and down the street and find Gage L who's in a Highway Crown Vic, and that was possibly, too. It, it just seems very unlikely. So I'm going to give it five more minutes and see if there's any more intel that comes in, and uh, we can kind of go from there. So I've just sent Blake a message asking if there's any more info on this target to see if we could uh, wrap this one up. So I'm going to wait till he gets back to me, and we're going to see from there. If there is no one else, at least we've had a successful first mission back into Agent 48.1. Of course, Agent 48 is on vacation, like we said in the beginning. Um, so we will see here shortly what Blake has to say. Okay, so the information he gives me, it says, All I know is he drives a highway, Vic, and it's 5 David 39, and it hangs out on the highway. Well, thanks for that information. I really appreciate that. Um, that's not much information at all. There could be a lot of guys driving Crown Victoria, so I don't really want to cap someone and not know if it's actually the target I'm supposed to be acquiring or not. Um, so I would say, I think I need to have ground rules and conditions. What I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna go check out what's going on on the highway, see if we happen to see anyone, maybe just one Vic that stands out. Um, other than that, I think we're gonna have to have ground rules and be like, what, you have to know exactly where kind of like they hang out, you have to know a little bit more about them, what they, dra uh, what they wear, what they drive, um, something, you know what I mean? Because it's a little difficult to create something out of nothing, if that makes any sense. Like, I, I, I can't... I don't know. It's difficult. So we're gonna go ahead. This is probably him. <laughs> Just the first one. <laughs> probably him. Motherfucker, dude. I don't know, though. Hangs out on the highway. This the highway's too big. The highway's too big. I don't feel like that contract would be satisfactory enough. Well, I went to do a sweep on the highway because he said, you know, that he drives a Vic, he stays out of the highway, but it's just not enough information to... Because the highway's so big and it's statewide. So if you don't know a, kind of like an area on where the target's at, I think we, can, I need, to, we need to have ground rules. We're going to do 48 stuff so that way we can actually get the things done. Because I can't just sit and roam around, nor do I want to cheat. I want to be able to have intel that I use for the first time ever and be able to come up with like, you know, a, a game plan there. That's, that's, I mean, I just love video games like that. So that's what I would like to do. So, I mean, yeah, see, there's a charger. I just, I don't know. Does that have a Ram bar on it? I think it might, it might not. I don't know. Um, so yeah, it's just, it's, it's a little difficult to find the people that I want to, um, find for this contract. So we're going to wrap it up here for this Hitman episode. Uh, Hit, Hitman Agent 48.1. Uh, comes out of the shadows, even though 48 is the one that's technically the main guy. Um, still the same guy, though. Um, we're going to go ahead and bring him out for some more contracts. We have Kelly that wanted to do some uh, type of contract, but she said here shortly. So that's going to give us an ability to have a contract coming up here soon, uh, which is always helpful. Get out of the way. Which is always helpful to keep these, um, you know, storylines going. So that way 48 doesn't kind of just go off into the abyss like he did last time just because there wasn't really many people to have contracts on but I guess maybe I don't need to have my contracts maybe I could fulfill other people's contracts which is what Hitman's supposed to be doing in the first place but thank you guys so much for coming out and watching this episode of DOJRP and the Agent 48.1 I really appreciate it guys and we will see you next episode <laughs>